Hi, folks. Time for another McFeely Minute here at KFGO.com. I am Mike McFeely, host of the Mike McFeely Show, each weekday, 2 to 5 p.m. in the mighty 790 KFGO and KFGO.com. It looks like Minnesota Republicans are starting to bring the Wisconsin fight to the west across uh, the river into Minnesota. Uh, Gretchen Hoffman, who is actually a local legislator here from Vergas, Minnesota, introduced a bill this week which she calls a very simple bill that would require public employees in Minnesota to contribute more to their pension funds. 3% more across the board for uh, different folks like correctional officers and anybody who works for the state in the state of Minnesota. She says it's not an attack on workers. It's not an attack on anybody. It's nothing more than just trying to get the state budget balanced in Minnesota. To which anybody with uh, <laughs> any bit of common sense at all is going to say, hooey. Because really what it is, is it's an attack on folks making middle incomes in the state of Minnesota. The average employee who belongs to the union that covers state employees in Minnesota makes $38,000 a year. $38,000 a year. And yet Gretchen Hoffman and her ilk want to make those people pay 3% more of their salary to help cover a pension fund that's not in trouble. At the same time, the Republicans, like Gretchen Hoffman, and others, to be fair, do not want to talk at all about taxing those in Minnesota who make a half million dollars a year, or a million dollars a year, or two million dollars a year. The money could easily be made up that's missing uh, from the Minnesota budget by temporarily taxing those folks who are making a million bucks a year. It's not going to sting them. People making 38 grand a year, is 3% going to hurt them? Yeah, I think it will because $38,000 a year is not a wealthy person, as some would have you believe, on the right side of the aisle. This has been another McFeely Minute here at KFGO.com. Join me every weekday, 2 to 5 p.m. on the Mighty 790 KFGO.